Welcome back to another Budokai Tenkaichi story mode playthrough. We are on, I believe, the fourth part of the Saiyan Saga. Battle 16. 16th battle. Goku versus Nappa. Let's go. Yep, Earth Wasteland. KO can attack within the time limit. Now you see, that means I have to build up meter. I have to get those balls, the blue balls, <laughs> to shine a bit. Go into KO Ken mode, then go into KO Ken attack. Okay, we get a different song. What's that's good. That look on your face. I don't like it. <laughs> I guess I'm just gonna have to kill you. Wow, Nappa. You're going to pay for what you've done. Can you guess what his power level is? You think a low life like you is gonna beat me? It won't happen. Slow motion. I I don't know if they actually do it in this. No, they don't. Ready? Vegeta, what does this counter say about his power level? Nappa beating the piss out of me. We all remember this, but Nappa was stronger than Goku. I think it was actually canon that Nappa was actually stronger than Goku. It's because Goku needs to use the KO Ken attack to uh, defeat Nappa. Are you kidding me? Okay, okay, that's that's enough. That's enough. That's enough. Goodbye, Nappa. I'm gonna hit him with a spirit bomb. Just because I can. How do I go into KO Ken mode? What do I need? Favorite technique, KO Ken. I think it's up L2 and circle. Okay. Wow. Well, let's let's check it again. Wow. Okay. There's KO Ken. Yeah, up L2 and circle. But I need, I need more power. Oh, that's right. I could have done the mini game to recover faster. Oh, come on! Stop it, Nappa! See, this is what sucks. To get into KO Ken mode, you have to go into KO Ken mode, then use the attack. There we go! He's pretty much done. Good night, Nappa. Sleep well. Vegeta, help me! I can't. I can't. There it is. I can't feel my legs. <laughs> well, Nappa's dead. Goku didn't kill him, he just defeated him. Yeah, baby! Clear! Now then, Goku versus Vegeta. Let's go. Earth Rocky Area. With a Kamehameha. Okay, that's good. I prefer it being the Kamehameha. Isn't it weird that in just about every Dragon Ball game from the PS2 era, Vegeta is an unlockable character? Oh, look at these cutscenes. I can't hear you over the sound of this music and the rocks crumbling in the background, Vegeta. Speak up! In other words, you were a reject. Damn. Even rejects can surpass the elite if they try hard enough. Yeah. Let's go, Vegeta. Well, let me assure you, no matter how hard you try, you'll never overcome this battle. Alright, well, I will overcome this fight, Fajitas. Ready? Let's go, Chicken Fajita! Man, I miss saying that. Come here, Fajitas. Oh, Fajita, you, you hit me, dude. Come on, show me what you got. Stop trying to grab me. Bad touch, Fajitas. Get out of here! We're about to do some damage to Fajitas here. Here comes the spirit bomb! There goes the spirit bomb! That sucked. I don't think so. Beams destroy these, by the way. In every Tenkaichi game. Okay, Fajita. Stop, 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 stop,
Stop, stop, stop, stop, stop, stop, stop, stop. Stop it. God damn it, Vegeta. Look, man, you want a full on spirit bomb to the face, take it. Take it. Just take it. There we go. That's all I needed. Oh, no. Fajita! Fajita, stop it! Oh, he knocked me out of my thing. Guard breaking it. Come on, man. Oh, right in the face! Suck on that, Vegeta. Oh, I fell, too. Looks like we're both dead. These cutscenes are incredible, by <laughs> the way. What? I don't believe the fight went like this. Yeah, I think it went a different way. Hmm. Well, hey, I'll take it. That's it. That's the end of the Saiyan Saga. That's right. No Great Ape Vegeta, no Gohan and Krillin come to the rescue. I'm kidding. It's all right here. Oh, boy. Great Ape Vegeta. Here we go. Survive until time runs out. Okay, well, I can do that. I can kind of do that. I don't want to do that, but I can do that. Let's go, Fajitas. Great Ape Vegeta, look at him. Look at him. No, huh? Goku, I'm sorry, just stretching. Yep, I got this. And he's just, I'm Great Ape Vegeta. <laughs> How do you like this, Kakarot? You're finished now. Well, you're a monkey. What's going on? A great Ape? Great Ape Monster. A great Ape Monster? I know people want me to say Ozaru, but. Some good news. I think As Great, great Ape. Ape I don't know. Maybe just, just monkey. It looks like it's going to take more energy than I've got to even have a chance of beating. We have to gather energy from the earth and hit him with a spirit bomb. Yeah, yeah, we got it. We got to do that. I totally forgot. We have to do that. Not. We have to survive until 60 seconds runs out. Oh dear God! That's right. Vegeta comes at you, dude. And you, you got nothing. Look at this. Look at that damage. That damage. Whew! Sorry, I guess I didn't know my own strength. Ha 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 Let's try it again. This fight is annoying as all hell. By the way, remember how I said uh, rush attacks are unblockable? Correction. Giants cannot be rush attacked. You can only do energy blasts, and that's it. So if your character's ultimate attack is a rush attack, it's not going to work. Skip this. Ready. I'm ready. Let's go. He comes right at you. Aha! Trying to, uh... Um, can I do a restart? Nope. Nope. Surrender, lose, or... Oh, wow. This is going to be a tough one to do. What I can do, if I get enough energy to hit the spirit bomb, I can try to run and hide because he has to look around and try to find me. Run and hide below, but good luck with that. I mean, you see him coming at you, right? Alright, fajitas. Let's try this again. We're going to do this until we win, by the way. Ready, go. Come at me, dude! Spam the hell out of Kamehameha's. Stay right there, I don't care. Joke's on you. Come on. Oh, I forgot. This is how you actually win this fight. Just spam. Oh my goodness! Spam the hell out of Kamehameha's if you can. Get him the hell away from you. And then he does super attacks, so. No, I should say heart attacks. Oh my goodness! Well, I almost had it. Not really. Whew! I guess the Saiyan Saga is going to be an extra long video now. An extra video, I should say. Survive until time runs out. This is a this is an awful fight, man. I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. I was about to say, what happened to my game? 
Okay, fajitas. I'll try this. Okay, boom, and then. Ah. Oh. There we go. Got him. There we go. Yeah. Goodbye, fajitas. We got this. Oh, I can just do that. There's nothing he can do. Oh, God. There's everything he can do. Oh, he just comes at you. Uh, where's my Kamehameha? I had it, too. I had him. I had him. I had him, but I just had to get cocky and try to throw something at him. One more time, or I should say until we win, but this is this is the last time. I promise, watch. There's nothing you can do here. You, you try to spin them around, nothing. Nothing happens. All right, let's go, fajitas. Ready, go. Suck on this. Got it. Okay. I think Goku also is the only character that might evolve in terms of combos when you play through story mode. I could be wrong. What I'm trying to do... Oh, damn it, I shouldn't have. I should just stick with this. I was going to try to hit him with a spirit bomb and run away, but... Doing this for the next 20 seconds seems to be the right idea. So, there we go. Until you do this. Goodbye! Oh, wow. I did it. Thank you. I survived until time ran out. Cheaply, but I did it. I did not skip that, by the way. The cutscene skipped itself. Yeah! We cleared it. Mm. First try, too. I'm the best at this game. <laughs> Don't you love the what-if battles? What if Great Ape Gohan fought Great Ape Vegeta? <laughs> That's great. You know what? We're going to... We're going to finish up the Saiyan Saga in this video. We're going to finish it up, and then we'll do the next saga in a separate video there, which I believe is a Frieza Saga, which also has a lot of damn fights. Rawr! Herbal stretching! <laughs> this is what's cool about this game, is a lot of the uh, what-if sagas and battles, like, um... We're about to see some sagas that I don't want to spoil anything, but there are a lot of fun what if sagas in this game. That's like the only really good. Look at this! Look at the great ape standing there. Let's fight! It's a giant ass kaiju battle. Let's go, baby! Of course, Great Ape Vegeta is ten times better. Because this Great Ape just sucks. Vegeta actually has combos. This one just flails his arms around and throws a freaking rock from thin air. Oh, what am I doing? Wow! That goes that far? In the other games, it doesn't even go that far. It just stays in a little area. Does it take up the whole arena? That's amazing. Amazingly busted. I have to defeat him. That's right, Great Ape Vegeta also has like a super gallic gun, which is annoying. Come on! Yeah, Super Mouth Blast! Mad so I can charge up. He found me. Wow, that, that move is busted at all. 
busted as all hell if it goes that far. Let's see which mouth blast is stronger, Vegeta! Yeah! Our first beam struggle! And he's dead. <laughs> Very anticlimactic. The beam struggles got so much better in the sequels, like the look of them. Those, those ones are lame. <laughs> this one they're lame. That's a good question. Which, by the way, I believe in uh, Tenkaichi 2, they add Yajirobe vs. Vegeta. Like I said, Tenkaichi 2 I love so much, just because it adds stupid fights like that. And like I said, I like this game for the what-if fights and the what-if sagas, but... Other than that, this game is garbage. It's terrible. It does not stand the test of time in terms of good Dragon Ball games. Da -da -dun -dun. Do it! There it is. Still haven't gotten a Dragon Ball, huh? Alright. Last fight. Great Ape Gohan against regular Vegeta. That's right, you don't even get to do Krillin versus Vegeta. You don't even get to do Goku having to use the Spirit Bomb against Vegeta. You just go right into the Great Ape battle against Vegeta. For once, they let you be overpowered, and then we're going to see the epilogue after. And then after that, we'll end the video. Rawr! What's up, Vegeta? You look, uh, you look healthy. Tail's back, I see. Grr. By the way, transformations aren't in this game, I believe. Like, um... There's no way to transform. I was not introduced into Tenkaichi 2. Basically, every character is their own separate character. Every transformation is their own separate character. Ow. Okay, Fajitas. I'm gonna beat you. Nice try. Have a rock for your troubles, my friend. I'm gonna power up here, because I, I got super armor. Apparently, Fajita's able to go through my super armor. Suck on that. Yeah! And... Correction, you'll get super armor. You get hyper armor. <laughs> it feels so good to be overpowered. Good night, Vegeta. Stop toying with me! Ah, uh, it's easy. I use the super explosive wave. Now then. Let's see that epilogue. Ah, oh, so good. 20 battles. 20 battles in the Saiyan Saga. Let's see the epilogue, and we'll end the video after that. Here's the epilogue. This is what's cool about this, too. The prologues and the epilogues at the end. Don't they talk? Oh, okay, I'll do it myself. Oh, there it is, yes. King Kai. This has been the prologue to this Okay. I should turn the music down just so we can hear King Kai talk. And hear the other characters talk. Anyway. That's it! Look at that! Yeah. You also get cool credits. Actually, I think that's because, um... I have, uh... Completed the game 100. We'll see. We'll see the credits another time. We'll see the credits another time. Anyway, that's it. I hope you enjoyed the Saiyan Saga of Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkai Ichi Z Gate, whatever the hell this freaking mode is called. The story mode. I'm just gonna say story mode. Story mode. Okay. Stay tuned for the next saga is none other than the Namek slash Frieza Saga. My name's Clinker Roth. I thank you all so much for watching. This is an awesome mode where you can relive Shenron's memories of all our greatest and most difficult battles. Open the Z